Hello people, this is Forty Splish Splash, and finally I am here to play Survive the DS Helix, getting into the first chapter. I'm not sure if this is actually me lying here. Well, there's a lot of questions and hopefully we'll get some answers. I also want to say thank you to Survive Studios here in Stockholm, Sweden, that has sent me the game. And also I was able to go there and make a nice interview with uh, the CEO and co-founder Fabiana, which was really fun and great, and you can check that out if you want to. But now, let's start to play. Chapter 1, Recruitment. Hmm. Oh, Detroit. Oh, I see a light. I'm walking into the light now. I'm waking up. Not really sure what's happening right now. Oh god, it's probably me being in the hospital, maybe lying in the bed that we saw in the menu. Oh, I hear people talking around me. Oh my. Can someone wake me up, please? Please wake me up. Please? Oh. You may be wondering where you are. Don't worry. These things will be made clear in time. You that sounds good. You look a bit pale, my friend. I am. And perhaps we should give you some ground below your feet. Your human senses usually require some concrete measurement of the tolerance <laughs> environment. How true. Oh, look. Below me here. I'm actually... Better? Oh, yeah, you're yeah, much better, thank you. Grab the ID bugs controllers to get started. Sure, I have them. Or do you want me to get the pair of new ones? Really? Good. Oh. Go ahead and push the blinking message button. Okay. Very good, my friend. Now we can communicate better. Hello. Whenever one of the message buttons are blinking, I have a message for you. Just keep clicking one of the message buttons to go through your messages. Okay, thank you. Now, I understand your confusion. Yes. Suddenly finding yourself floating through space and time. Let me explain. Please do. I the fact is, my friend, you're dead. Simply put. What? Dead? No. Uh, not to worry. We have only abducted you from your earthly life to join our workforce. Oh. You're now an ID Bugs agent. Congratulations, Agent Noll. Oh, thank you. Promotion, I guess. Oh, and I should probably introduce myself. My name is Nicodemus Salinger, ID Bugs Recruitment Officer Level 4. And I shall be your guide on this mission. Pleased to meet you. You are about to embark on an important quest. A oh. mission to save the universe. Congratulations. Yes, thank you. If you succeed in saving the universe, we shall also give you your life back. Congratulations again. Yes, I can get my life back. I want to do this right now. Let's get you started. At your workstation, your first case cube is already waiting. Mm. Best of luck. Oh, look at this. We're at a new place. Beautiful. Oh, we got a message. Welcome to your workstation, agent. Uh -huh. This is where you start your missions and also where you archive any DNA you find. Beautiful. Feel free to have a look around. I sure will. Hmm, that cube is spinning there. Looks almost the same as we saw before. Before you get started, however, let me tell you more about your actual mission. Okay. Your job is to locate and reconnect the missing pieces of the Deus Helix. The missing pieces. What's the Deus Helix, you might ask? Yes, I am well, asking. It's a genetic code. The DNA holding the key to control the universe. All right. Hmm. Pieces of the Deus Helix are scattered across the galaxies, 
protected by the so-called Susuri Guardians. Susuri Guardians. But dark forces are now closing in, trying to steal the Helix. We have to stop that. We have to stop it. If you succeed in reconnecting the Dis Helix fast, peace will be restored in the universe, and you will live again. Hmm. But if you fail, our entire universe will be lost, and you will never return to life. Really? Haha, <laughs> no pressure, no pressure. Oh, no time to spare. When you're ready to start working, grab your first case cube and bring it over to the portal. Hmm, I thought so. I thought so, bro. Okay, time to go, guys. Time to put it in here. And I think, uh... Here we go. Oh. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in this room. And for those of you that checked out my gameplay when it comes to the demo, well, I think you kind of recognize this. But we have a message. Okay, agent. You must quickly locate the hidden <laughs> helix. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Just like that. Just like that. Okay. Well. I better start searching. Now what's this? Kind of radio? Can I use it? Yes, changing the channel and everything. Not so much. Ooh, it's kind of spooky scary in here, a bit dark and... Well, oh my god. I'm just gonna look around a bit, guys see what we can find here's that weird painting and if you look carefully you can see a keyhole a keyhole there has to be something to it right is there something i can find here i don't think so it doesn't look like it some uh books no time to read can you open them no Now this door is obviously locked, I can't get in there. Can I... Oh shit, that was not good. I just got the light kind of not going well there. <clears throat> Either way, what's in here? Something called... What is it saying? Morning wind. <laughs> Interesting title of a book. There's a sound like a train or something. If you look carefully here, you can see this kind of passage, the screws here when it comes to the uh, ventilation. I think they can be fixed somewhat, but we need a screwdriver, some tools. So I, I do think we're gonna go in here. Let's move on. Oh, what is this? What a weird place. Is this a mirror? I can see the light, but nothing more. What do we have here? What is this? Again, I will try to search the place and see what I can find. I have a message. Wait. Shh. Be quiet. What? The guardian is close by. No. Don't move until I tell you it's safe again. Oh, really? I will not move. I hear footsteps. Okay. All clear. Continue your mission, agent. But be careful. Of course I will. But what do we have here? Look at this. It's an axe. Okay, guys, I will try to to break the lock with the axe. I actually did. I'm gonna put it here. Maybe I'll need it later. I don't know. Oh, shit. Let's be careful in here. Hello? Anyone inside? No. Hello? Oh god, these places. 
So we have some stuff here, some tools, hammer and things, more candles, but I can't see a, a screwdriver, can I? But wait, what's over there? Wait a second. Oh God. What's this? Something here? Oh! Oh, check out here, guys. It's a screwdriver. Okay, now we can uh, probably use it in the first room, right? I'm talking very soft, I know. And look at that, we have a light bulb. Maybe we can use them as well. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, beautiful. Sweet. Okay, we're getting the job done. That is good. Now I'm just gonna... I have to remember now where I put things. I, I wish I had a tool belt or something. But for now it's gonna be there. I'm gonna take this out. Oh shit, what's that? Cockroaches? Is there something in here that is of value? What is this? What is it? Just another... It's empty, right? This light bulb. I guess that's the right word. Because... And now I'm gonna actually leave the light here. I'm gonna go over here. Let's see. Oh shit. <gasps> oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Stay calm, stay calm. I kind of, kind of remember this from uh, the demo. I'm not sure if um, this pink or purple kind of. Oh, I got a message. No, 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 no. Good work, Kajit. You're making progress. Remember to stay quiet and be quick. Yes, I am quiet, but I'm not sure I'm quick. Huh. Okay. Again, I'm pretty curious about this paint and, and this keyhole again. So again, we have to be very focused. Let's see if we can actually find what we're searching for, which for me right now, I don't really know. But I think I'm gonna try to use this freaking radio again. All right, maybe Hello? 1926 keyhole. Hello? Hello? I hear a voice. Could this be some? How, how far can you? Hello? 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 I hear this. Hello? Voice. Oh, I, I should definitely need a drink. Can I? No, oh, I don't know what it is, but I'm thirsty for real. The thing is, it's a lot of symbols and stuff, and I think the main kind of message we have here is over there, 1926, just over the keyhole. But what the heck? What should we do to, to make it happen? Let's start looking again. What about the mattress? Is it something underneath? No. Shit. I'm trying to kick it. That doesn't work. <laughs> Sometimes when I play, I do see that the tracking kind of messes up a bit because I all of a sudden see my controller walking like away from me, being a bit further out. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm just wondering what I'm freaking looking for. Lights out. What do you mean by that? Lights out. Okay, I have the. Well, it's good that I kind of remember, or actually by accident, start to realize that I have this flashlight. So, what I'm gonna do now is go over here. And I'm actually gonna do like this. Is there something? 
I can find in the dark. I don't know. Is it something that I've missed here? Anything? No? What the heck is that sound? Oh my god. Saw so it taking out the light again and looking around to try to see what I can actually find here. And I'm gonna put this purple one back or whatever it is. <laughs> Illuminates the whole room at least. And I don't think I need a flashlight for now. So I'm gonna turn it off and get back to work. So guys, we're starting our journey as Agent Null. <laughs> whatever so. And we're in this mysterious room or rooms. And we've got a bit ahead, but still, there's so much to do and to get even further into it. If you scratch the surface, I can tell you that I can already sense it. And we're gonna fix this, and that we're gonna do in the next episode, guys. So take care, hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think about what you've seen so far in the comment section, and we take it from there. This was Forty Splish Splash. Take care, guys. Over now. Bye-bye.